I was wrong about Ira. I thought he would make a great leader, but he let me down. Well, what do you two think? You don't believe what Ira said, do you? Of course not. His argument was unconvincing. It's like Inby said. He's just making baseless assumptions given the situation. There's no evidence to tie his accusations to anyone, let alone one of us. <sighs> Maybe there's something he hasn't told us. And he needs to tell us! How dare he look at us with suspicion! We're his comrades! I wouldn't call us comrades. Anyway, could you get to the point? I know you didn't call us here just to complain. I want the three of us to form an alliance. But alliances are forbidden, I said. I knew it. I had a feeling it would come to this. So, we join forces, then confront Ira? Confronting him is pointless. Ira won't change his mind. I know there's darkness at work. There's no question. But, I don't believe for a second there's a traitor among us. Unfortunately, Ira doesn't share the same belief. He's just wasting time trying to figure out who the traitor is. But darkness won't wait, and neither should we. We need to band together now, and find a way to fight it! Hmm. Guess it makes sense. I agree that we need to do something to fight the darkness. But combining our unions? That was strictly forbidden by the Master. He's no longer here. I'm in. But let's be clear. The Alliance is just between the two of us right now. I don't want my union members involved. Gula! Oh. I want... I want to follow the Master's teachings. Understood. That's your choice to make. You should do whatever you feel is right. Yeah. By the way, Ased, do Ira and Inbi know? I haven't talked to Ira about it for obvious reasons, but I did ask Envy to join us. You wanted to see me? Uh, Gula, Ava, what are you doing here? What's the meaning of this? Hear me out, Envy. I want an alliance among our unions. Gula here has already agreed. 
Will you join us? And together we and can- And disobey the Master's teachings? We don't have a choice! Darkness is approaching and we need to combine our strength to stand against it. The Master bestowed each of us with a different role and he specifically told us to keep our union separate, to maintain the balance of power. He told us that any imbalance would lead to a desire for more power, which leads to darkness. I know you haven't forgotten. Perhaps it's you who has been tainted by darkness. I'm tainted by darkness? Then what about you, Envy? You spy on us and report everything you see back to Ira. You really think you have no darkness in your heart after what you did? Because that is my role. To observe us, yes. But not to disclose everything we say and do to Ira. That's... For all we know, you and Ira could be allies, scheming behind our backs. That's enough.
When will it stop? I don't want us to turn against each other. Master Alva! Uh, oh, hello. Your name is Ephemer, right? Uh-huh. Uh, hey, can I join you? Uh-huh. <clears throat> Why the long face? Did something happen? Hmm. Long day. Do you remember what you asked me before? About why the unions compete against each other instead of working together? Actually, I always wondered the same thing. Huh? Isn't it just because the Master said so? Yes. And as such, we must obey. The Master said so. So it is. Lately, I've really started to wonder. You once told me that you were looking for answers. That you wanted to solve the mysteries of this world. Well, I think that's how things should be. We need to question things and think for ourselves. Whoa! You are really not yourself today. I guess even foretellers have their off days. Hey, maybe talking about the book will cheer you up. Not a chance. Aww. Hm. You were trying to pull a fast one on me, weren't you? Oh, no, no, I was joking. If you say so. But, to be honest, I think it would be great if all the unions could work together and be friends. <sighs> you know... I made a friend from another union today. Wasn't much of a talker, maybe just shy. We're meeting again tomorrow. That sounds like so much fun. Then you'd better go home and get some sleep. Okay. <sighs> well, it was nice talking to you. I don't know what's got you down, but please cheer up. Thank you. The worst happens. I'll be glad to leave the future to the kids who see the world in the way that you do. Let the wind carry you far, far away. My dandelions.
Envy, have you learned something? It seems Ased and Gula's unions are now allied. So Ased is the traitor after all? No, I don't believe he is. Why is that? To Ased, unification is a means of gathering strength to oppose the darkness. So I believe his heart still belongs to the light. Even so, forming alliances was strictly forbidden by the Master. Yes, and his teachings are absolute. That's why I will try and persuade Gula to dissolve their alliance. Then I'll do it. No. Please, let me do the talking. Your intervention will do nothing more than spur Asad's anger. All right. I'll leave it to you. And one more thing. Asad has begun to question the two of us. As a precaution, my reports will be less frequent. I don't want him to get the wrong idea. Please understand. Yes, I do.
Thank you. 